It's the mindset Free your mind Free your mind Mindset Free your mind Free your mind Hey, not everything that glitter is gold Not everything that's white is snow On the mindset I just start let them know Let them know, let them know Oh, words from the wise I just star, we will never lie Stand tall, we will never die We'll forever shine I just star, shine like the star in the sky Some hate, some love I insert blessed love, manners and respect Do give thanks and praise for life, health and strength One more day above ground And I want to greet the item in the divine name of his imperial majesty Emperor Eel Selassie I the first Yes, beautiful viewers and subscribers, we're there and we are looking upon um, two prolific um, figures within the music um, industry, reggae music, and we are looking upon legendary, legendary Burning Spear, original known as um, Winston Rodney. Zane, yes, and we are also looking at Honorable Miguel Collins, Sizzla, Colonge. All right, so what we are looking for? We are looking for Burning Spear. Burning Spear, take the street. Again, Burning Spear, dip on the road. Again, um, coming this August in Europe, in Spain, um, for, for one of the major festivals, which I think is Rotterdam Festival. All right, so. Well, for us, uh, bring an uh, article to the item, Zane. For many years, Burning Spear held the unofficial title of best touring reggae artist almost 20 years ago. He retired from the road and not much been heard from him. Two weeks ago, it was announced that the legendary singer-songwriter will make a comeback at the Rotterdam Festival in Spain. Rotterdam Sound Splash in Spain, August. He is also booked for the Welcome to Jamra Cruise in December. Burning Spear 77 spoke to the Jamaica Gleaner from his home in New York. He said one thing. Lured him out of retirement. It has been a long time since I've done any shows, but it is not like I am bored or anything like that. It is the call of the people. They haven't seen Spear in a long time, he said. He hinted that there will be likely additional dates in 2022, but those locations depend on the demand. It is also about the people who want to see Spear. He said, the music industry has transformed significantly since Burning Spear stepped it away from, the, from touring. Back then, the... Back then, the compact disc was vogue and the promoters in Europe and the United States were willing to book reggae acts with their band. Streaming platforms such as Spotify and SoundCloud are now the source of the music for generation. Why reggae tours even um, before COVID-19 had scaled down considerably considerably due to the rising um, production costs so where am i say um, a lot of the shows them have been scaled on before COVID 19 with a catalog laden with classic songs like swell edit marcus garvey traditional burning spear is not concerned about his music reaching new fans a new generation of fans will always know my music just like bob marley music music is for different generation that the way our music is he, he stated his latest uh, studio album ja is real was released in 2008 it gave him 
a second Grammy Award for Best Reggae Album since the mid-1970s when he broke through with the powerful Marcus Garvey album, Bernie Spear established himself as a formidable touring act. His legendary streak sometime last six months. Europe was his happy hunting ground. He also has a considerable considerable following in the United States and Japan. Spear has performed intermediately in Jamaica, but say he has not been home in five years. He maintained ties to the country through his charity, which donated money and ass assorted time items to an infirmary and infant school in the native St. Anne's Bay as well as a place of need in St. Mary. All through his recording career uh, started in the late 60s a Studio One Bernie, a Studio One Bernie Spear is um, synonymous with the cinema Burn Marcus Garvey album produced by Lawrence Jack Ruby Lynn Lindo. His, con his conviction to the Pan African icon and Jamaican first national era is unyielding. Re recently, the Jamaican government announced plans to lobby the administration of the US, US President Joe Biden to exonerate Marcus Garvey as a male fraud which resulted in a two-year federal prison sentence during the 1920s. As Jamaica celebrates celebrate the 60th anniversary of independence, Burning Spear insists the government need to do more to educate the country. Youths about Garvey, who was also a uh, sent as native there need to be a subject on Gavi from the basic school up them still talking about christopher columbus it's time for jamaican people to speak on these things he said and that is the end of the article and um i think um burning spear have a strong point there you know we need to be talking more about marcus Gavi from basic school up to university level zane and that would do a great good for you know the nation uh a people in jamaica zane because half of the people them out there don't really know much about garvey you know what i mean because garvey as one do not appeal to some of them because of what he stood for you understand? So you find out, say, them shun Gavi and them try to hold down the teachings of Marcus Gavi in every and which way they can. So the people mind do not elevate and excel beyond what them can really achieve and attain in life. You know what I mean? So that is where we at with Burning Spear. We know, um, I think last year, you know, Burning Spear... We see him come out and him take the joke and all these things and a lot of people was disappointed with um the legendary reggae artist. I for one, um, you know, we love Burning Spear music. You know what I mean? And you know, we love him as a brother too, but at the same time, you know, everyone have, you know, them choice and um, you know, sometimes we have to just respect the choice that people choose to make in life because at the end of the day it's their life so make we keep it moving make we look upon um, the indigenous president of the Nyabingi theocracy in the reign honorable miguel collins otherwise known as sizzler colondry and we just go through sizzler um instagram for you know the last couple of days and you know some quiet instagram interesting posts you know with captions like social worker need their money africans rise up now we are not slave love what you do you are an african the chains start with you we are young but we 
are blessed that is one of um the posts that we see came out from um sister Kolonji. another one that is quite interested also zane is educate and feed your people by any means stand at the gate and judge in righteousness and peace Ethiopia, Africa, we are coming home. Repatriation and reparation. Now return all what you have stolen from Ethiopia, Africa. And I write this uh, it there with um, Sister Kolonji. Those are two posts that, um, you know, it's quite, quite interesting and appealing. And, you know, we have to, you know, bring these things to the eye them. Awareness, awareness is not everything. You know what I mean? The item go and see. So what the item not say? You know what I mean? We just drop it right here. So we give thanks to the item patient listening and rapid attention. We're keeping it moving. And um till we see the item on the rebound, Holy man will lie. So last see I ja Rastafari. I just star. Mindset. Cut and clear. Smash that subscribe button. See you on the next video. I just start the mindset.